Howdy folks! In this video I would like to show you how to change the page margins in Microsoft Word and Office 365. So generally you're working on your home tab but what you want to do is go up to your ribbon here and click on layout and then on the left hand side you'll find margins. When you click on margins you'll see some pre-configured options. Normal is one inch on all sides but if you're looking for uh, margins that can give you more text and, and pictures per page, you can choose narrow, for example. All right, that'll bring everything down to half an inch. And with that, of course, uh, you can reduce your page size or, or your page count, I should say, for your document. Now, if your pre-configured options aren't exactly what you're looking for. If you don't see something appropriate for yourself, you can click on custom margins. Okay, and here's where you can define the margins for each side independently, right? So when you're doing so, keep in mind that uh, many printers, most printers actually can't print to the very edge of the page. So you have to know what your printer's actual physical limitations are uh, when you're setting up these margins. Generally speaking, you can go down to as little as a quarter of an inch. So if we put uh, 0 0.25 inches on each side and clicked OK, we could get even much narrower margins, right? But um, not all printers will support that. Sometimes uh, it's odd where uh, you know, the left side of the printer can go to a quarter inch, but uh, the right hand side is going to be, uh, you know, three quarters of an inch or something. So uh, just keep that in mind. You might want to do a bit of testing with your printer to make sure that you're not getting words cut off on the edge. And of course, if you want to switch everything back to normal, you can always click on margins and click on normal. Now, just looking at the custom margins area once more, um, there are other options here like the gutter position which is important when you're printing certain kinds of documents uh, particularly in, you know in a book type format and there are uh, other options here such as whether you want the margins to apply to the whole document or just this point forward right and um, there are page multiple page options here where you could have uh, mirrored margins, for example, uh, if you got a thin edge on the right for the first page, it'll be a thin edge on the left for the second page, right? Again, that would be when you're doing pamphlets or books, that kind of thing. So uh, this is your area for uh, extreme customization of margins. Hopefully this has helped you. Thanks for watching.